it here. Look, I'm not normally one of those people that likes to create news by scaring you. I'm not here to sensationalize. I don't want to start any controversy. I'm not going to stir the pot. I won't saute the artichoke. <laughs> but I cannot stay silent anymore. No longer can I stay silent. People, there is something going on with Tupperware. <laughs> Let me repeat that. There is something going on with Tupperware. Say it with me. Something is going on with Tupperware. Something is going on with Tupperware. Just the fellas. Something is going on with Tupperware. Ladies now. Something is going on with Tupperware. Remix. Here's what happened. The other night, Portia made some red beans and rice, and she watches the show, so they were delicious. And no, they're, they're, she's, she's a good cook. So anyway, so there were some leftovers, and um, so I went to my Tupperware drawer to find the perfect piece of Tupperware to pour the leftovers in. And you want one that's big enough to fit all the leftovers in, but not so big that it takes up space in your fridge, and you're like, oh, I didn't need one that big. Anyway, so long story short, I find the perfect one, and I filled it right to the top, but not too high where it's going to be a problem, and it was beautiful. I felt it one with the universe. And so <laughs> I have my red beans and rice. It's in my Tupperware, and now I have to look for the lid. So I look for the lid drawer, and uh, all organized, all the lids are in the lid drawer, and I have to find the, the perfect circle that fits the Tupperware. So I find... The, the perfect one, or so I thought. I press it down, and you know, you have to go all the way around on the side to get to that place where you burp it, which is always fun. And so I go all the way around, and it, it pops up, and I keep going around and around, and, it, and it's like, it's almost right, but it's a tenth of a centimeter too small. But I know it's gotta be the right one, because why would I buy Tupperware one size, and then a different one that's one tenth of a centimeter smaller? I'm rich, but I'm not that rich. So I do what any sensible person would do. I, I try and stretch the lid. And I know plastic doesn't work that way, but I don't care. So I keep <laughs> pushing and pushing, and I pull. I start sweating. I'm using rubber mallets to, like, hit it down. I've given up on, on relationships faster than I've given up on trying to close lids. I check every lid in the drawer, and none of them fit that container. What is happening? Where do the lids go? Are they, are they messing with us? Do they, are they running off with one sock? What is happening? <laughs> By the way, why is there only one sock when you see it in the road? It's just one. It's not two. And, and why is it wet? That's my question. That's a whole different thing. Anyway, someone out there, if you have a solution, please let me know. And don't tell me to use the cling wrap, because the cling stuff just starts sticking to each other before you even get it out of the box. So anyway, this is stressing me out. And I didn't mean to start the show this way. Let's just forget what I said. And let's just